You stand by the wreck, waiting for the sparks and the flames to die down, keeping a safe distance just in case anything explodes or pops off. A battery, a fuel canister, stowed ammunition, anything that might explode. Eventually it's just smouldering, and you decide to risk it, scrambling over what remains of the wreck, looking for something, anything that you can use to help Nothing seems to have really survived in any kind of useful state. You tear off panels, rip through what remains of the cargo hold, look everywhere for anything that might be of any use, but everything is punctured or broken or melted, and you're about to give up when you finally find a stash of repair parts used all the time to just basically upkeep the ship. That seems to have survived, and it's kind of like a survival kit for a ship. Add that to what you already have, and at least you've got some tools and some parts in case part of your armor breaks down, or your gun breaks, or you find some derelict piece of equipment somewhere on this godforsaken planet. You'll knelt down going through this when you're caught completely blindsided and smashed to one side. You whip your head around and see, sort of see, it's kind of translucent, kind of blending into the jungle behind it. But you see a great, hulking, predatory creature with drool dripping from its maw, circling backwards and forwards, prowling on its great big paws. And behind it, you think you see others. They must have been attracted by the crash and the smoke and the noises that you've made as you've moved around. You must sound like prey. And any minute, all of them are going to pounce. Monster misbehaving, planets needing saving, situations graven. I'll form the head. The enemy is better. We're smaller, but whatever. When we put it together, I'll form the head. Y'all can do the training. Swing energy machete. His combination's ready. I'll form the head. I'll form.